Nigga, kill over a bitch, but let a rat keep his wife. Time to go to work. Uh, hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. I'm just trying to beat the odds in. You can help me. Hit the like button right now. Why wouldn't you want to help me? Come on, now. And none of the big homies for, you know, what they did in the East Streets. And, you know, how much money. Hey, I'm just saying, me and Meech, we did the biggest. We made it look good. We put that face. We made them folk come get up. It ain't fun having all that money. You can't put it in. Now, y'all going to tell me that pop that harder than me and me. That's cap. That's cap. I was the first young in the city of Atlanta with a Lamborghini at such a young age. Bought this whole community. Had tons and tons of money on planes and jets and shit. So, look, I ain't discrediting the name and caca and nothing. But, man, me, we did it the biggest. We had fun. And then the other didn't even know how to dress, like, stop playing, like, talking about Rick Ross, and I ain't know how to dress. I keep talking about old oh, dude, them, that did they thing back in the day, they're cool now, but come on, dog. Now, y'all know them, got them big, ugly, uh, church suits on and shit, man. Y'all couldn't even get movies and shit, black and white back then. And, yeah, we put that shit in face, swagged up, chained up, jetted up. Bad bitches there. Well, come on, man. Y'all can't can't be serious. I don't want to hear all that. Y'all them y'all looked up to them. These people of our generation wanting Rollo and meet you know. That's just what it is, bro. So we got Rollo speaking on Meech. You know Rollo, Mr. Dog Food from Atlanta. Made a lot of noise with that dog fool, even with the with the with the tree tree. He 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 done did his thing, he done bought up the neighborhoods, bought bought all type of whips, took care of the family, took care of his niggas. So I understand why he's saying we did it the biggest. Me and Meech did it the biggest, but it is people that did it bigger than you, for sure, Rallo. It's people from Detroit that did it bigger than you. And I rock with you, but you can't be jumping off saying me and me did it the biggest. You did do it big. And you did things that people didn't do at a young age. Yes, yes, you did. But you didn't do it the biggest. Now, Meech, colossal. Different level. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a different level. Meech is out, y'all. And Rollo wasn't saying nothing out the way. He actually showing love, but you know, you're going to have some people on the internet like, oh, you saying you did it big. You ain't nothing like Meech, this and that. But y'all got to know, long time ago, and I remember Rollo had been showing love before he was finna get out, before anybody knew he was going to get out. Rollo had been screaming free Meech and, you know, but you had to been following Rollo to know this. And I've been rocking with Rollo for a long time. So what he's saying is, OG... Big Meech, get out, stay out the way. The streets is not the same. These niggas ain't the same. Which I don't think Rollo got to tell him that. You know, them niggas in jail get, get word before we do on the street. It's crazy how that happened. And not only that, he a big dog. So if you think he don't know about something, he know. His ties is his ties. Them ties ain't went nowhere. Except for the ones that was telling and snitching like Blue Da Vinci. Of course we know. You know what I'm saying? But as far as being in touch with the streets, I'm pretty sure he's still in touch with the streets. Should he go back to the streets? No, 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 no. You gonna be hot forever, Meech. It just is what it is. And streets is, is over with. It's still some money out here. But it's so many cameras, so many rats, so many rap songs, people you deal with. You may go deal with somebody and then they put you in a rap. You never know. And then you got to go right back to that place because you out on the tail. You get what I'm saying? 
you out on the till. So anything happened, you had to go back and serve that time. And as far as uh, Rollo go, I know some people like, Rollo been speaking on everything. Listen, Rollo get paid for this like I get paid for this like the next man get paid for this. So y'all could call him what y'all want, but he get paid every time y'all comment or say something about him. It's a reason why he say this. And the way he was putting it, like, we the biggest. I think he just trolling just to, just to ruffle some feathers. Because like I said, there's some, some people that came out of Detroit. I know for sure was bigger than uh, Rallo. And not only being bigger than him, I think he just talking about the appearance-wise. Uh, how people was dressing, the cars they was driving, clubs they was pulling up to. But Rallo got to understand, it was other men that was happy y'all was doing that. And they could do that 10 times too. They just didn't because they wanted y'all out the way. When y'all shining like that and everything, oh, then people coming, they coming to everybody, but they coming to you first. You the first stop. So when you think like, oh, we did it the biggest and we did this, some people chose not to do it as far as for image or what they drive or this and that. They did it for power. Structure, family, money, power, respect. So don't get on camera knocking people talking about, oh, we did it big. Just because they didn't do it like you don't mean they couldn't. Just like when you speak on Rick Ross. You wasn't making what the real Rick Ross make. Do you know what the real Rick Ross was making every day? We talking about freeway? Rick, Ricky Ross? Come on now, Rallo. That's why you got to watch what you say. Because there's so much info out there. People will get on your bumper for saying certain things. Now, I'm going to put it out there. That don't mean I don't mess with you. But I got to call a spade a spade. I have to call it what it is. It just is what it is. Nah. You can't get mad at me. Y'all can't get mad at me. We're calling it what it is. There's some dudes out of out of out of Detroit that was bumping elbows with El Chapo. You get me? And then kind of went a level higher than El Chapo was bumping elbows with the old man that was next to El Chapo, who was the real plug. You know, Chapo was just. The distribution, he just handled distribution. He was a distributor. The plug plug was the old man. And if you know anything about them, you know how big they was. And there's no way you did it bigger than that, Rallo. Did you do it big? Yes. Did you do what these niggas didn't do? Buy back the hood? Yes. Take care of your niggas. Everybody has somewhere to stay? Yes. You did that. But just because people didn't do exactly what you did don't mean they didn't have it. It don't mean it don't mean they wasn't having their way. It mean they were scared of what was coming to them or what could happen. Then people watching and it get crazy. They coming. So you got to watch what you do. It ain't all about stunting. It's about how you do it. You get in the game and you get out. Some people wasn't able to get out. They got caught up and they only way out was going to jail, then getting out and being done with the game. But me. Street's done. Rollo right about that. Lead that where it's set. Because these niggas ain't right. Y'all leave a, leave a comment. Hit the like button for me. And I'll be back with another one. Subscribe. Sus hit the button. Subscribe. Appreciate you.